Hey there, it's Mark Dickinson. I wanted to go over a request that I keep seeing in the HoneyBook community, and uh, it is about printing contracts and proposals. So let's take a look and see what we have to do here. Uh, currently, HoneyBook does not have uh, an easy way to just print a blank contract or proposal. But what we're going to do is we're going to jump into the agreement section where there's a wedding agreement that I have here currently. And as you can see here uh, at the top, normally there's the uh, ellipsis, I think it's called, or the three dots that show uh, more options, but on the templates it does not have that. But I'm going to show you a really easy way to print this one out. So let's grab the text here with your mouse, drag right down to the very bottom, and you're going to right click and then click print. Now, what this is going to do is going to bring it up into a nice window. It's going to look really clean uh, compared to doing it the other way, which I'll show you in just a minute. And then from there, what you want to do is you want to come up here to the top left where it says change, click change, and do save as a PDF. And then from that section, you want to save it. There's gonna be a total of four pages. We'll do sample contract for wedding. So that's the next thing we're gonna do. Save it to a known location that's going to be easy to find later on, which is like the desktop. Save it here, and that is all you need to do. Now, the other way that you can do it is you can go into an event or any event that has a proposal or contract listed in there and do it this method here, and I'll show you that. So let's find a contract and a proposal and we're going to see that it populates all the information in here. And at the top right, you'll see the uh, ellipsis there. And you can print that. So it's going to show all the information here. If you want to skip over that, you can. Then you can come down to the Photography Agreement page, which is page 3 of 7. Type in here, 3 hyphen 7. That's going to print out just 3 through 7. And if you don't want the last page where the si signature is there, you just change that to 6. It will omit that page or remove it and then you can save that as a contract from HoneyBook. Let's do that there and see how that works. So we're gonna save that one again to the desktop and we'll compare the two to see what they look like. So we have a sample contract right here, which is that. And let me bring this down and grab the other one, same thing. So we have these two contracts here. You'll see that they're very similar. Uh, the one from HoneyBook seems to center itself better. The font is a little bit smaller. So whichever one you want to use, you can but they all have the same information in there. It doesn't look like it cuts it off a specific time frame. Yeah, it looks like everything is uh, in there. So if you want to send this to someone now, you can uh, send them a sample contract without having any signatures on it, as a lot of people have been requesting. So let's close all these, and we're going to go back into HoneyBook here and see what happens when you try to print the contract from the template. So stand by just a sec. So once you're in here and you do templates and you go to agreements, you do the wedding agreement. If you just come in here and do print by itself, then you're going to see that the left hand border overlays the photography agreement and there's no way to get rid of that. So the best method to do is select it from the text as I did there and grab it with the mouse and then print and convert that over to PDF. So guys, I hope you appreciate it. Thanks for liking and commenting. If you'd like to see more videos, subscribe and I will see you next time. Thanks a lot.